Need to make a video presentation, but you just don't know how to get started? Whew. Relax. It's easier than you think, even if you're a beginner. I'm Nick from Powtoon, and it's time to learn not one, but two methods to turn any slide deck into a killer video presentation. Remember to like this video and subscribe so that the algorithms can learn how to make a video presentation too. And <laughs> let's dive right in. Okay, two ways to make a video presentation. Now this assumes you already have your presentation created. If you need some tips on that, click above for our video, how to make an animated presentation. First method is to simply add voiceovers to your existing slide deck. This is super easy to do. I recommend you do this slide by slide. Inside the Powtoon Studio, what you want to do is load up your presentation, click add voiceover, click record, and then you'll have a handy dandy countdown here to get ready. You want to be nice and succinct. Be sure that you've got the tightest version of your message for each slide. Record it. When you're done, click stop record and apply that to the timeline. Do that for all your slides. Then you've got your the basis of your presentation together there. But in order to really make it a video presentation, you want to give it that video feel. Add a soundtrack. Go to sound. Click the uh, soundtrack library. You can filter for different moods. Choose the track you want. You want to apply it to your entire Powtoon. And you also want to make sure that you adjust that volume. You want to bring it down. The soundtrack's going to be kind of loud. Bring it down so that you can hear your voiceover on all the slides. Your last step there is to export your video, right? Once was a presentation, now will be a video. Click download MP4 or upload to all of those uh, various video platforms there and you've got yourself a video presentation. What about method number two? Method number two, very close to my heart, deliver and capture your presentation. That begins and ends, my friends, with getting the Powtoon Capture Chrome extension. That's our Chrome, Google Chrome extension for recording your screen or your webcam uh, or both. And actually, that's what I've been using in this presentation. Let me show you how it works. Once you've downloaded the extension and you've got it installed into your browser. You can just click here to get access to it. We've got present mode, which just puts your uh, camera window onto the screen. You can choose different designs here like that. You can customize, change the size, uh, or you can even record, right? This is so easy. So just like we've been doing here, you load up your presentation, hit present, open up capture, hit record. You'll get another uh, countdown once you select the screen you want to share and get ready to give your presentation. Then you simply tab through your slides like you normally would and talk through the content of it. Uh, alert or oh wait something's wrong here. Alert. Ugh, what's let's jump out of the presentation and find out what what just happened there. Alert, ladies and gentlemen, when you're, when you're giving your presentation in Powtoon, advancing the slide is just going to play your slide from beginning to end, and it's going to pause a half a second before the end. So you're going to want to be sure that, especially if you've got text or something like that showing up, that it all shows up before a half second before the end, or else you're not going to be able to see it when you're giving your presentation. So just be sure that you move your text earlier so that it appears in time. Another alternative is to simply extend your slide length and you're good to go. Again, when you're ready to give your presentation, load it up in the studio, click present and tab through your slides just like you normally would. And one thing I want to say about your presentation here, you definitely want to smile, make eye contact with the camera now and again, right? Uh, you want to sit up straight and be sure that you're speaking with confidence. After all, you've worked hard to create this presentation. You've poured your heart and your soul into it, right? Uh, and you want to be able to share that with the same kind of confidence you feel on the inside. Now, let's see how our fixed slide looks uh, when we tab through. Alert. Watch your timing. Everything appears in time. No problem at all. I just want to give you one last tip. Remember that your camera window, when you're using Powtoon Capture, you, you can move it around, you can drag it, you can even use it as an element 
in your presentation. Don't forget to use this space. Don't forget to put your face between your audience and the presentation so that your information and your narration of it comes alive. I want to thank you. Thank you guys down there. I want to thank all of you who watched this. Uh, be sure to thank your audience when you're done giving your presentation. And then all you need to do to stop recording is to either click this stop button or you can even just click the icon for the Chrome extension Powtoon Capture right there. This will stop the recording and load up your player page. Once your player page is loaded, you can retitle your capture right here. We'll call this my video presentation presentation or whatever is going to be enticing to your audience. You can share this page right here with all these options or go into export options if you want to upload directly to any of these platforms or download an MP4. Thank you, thank you, ladies, gentlemen, non-binaries, friends. Thank you for attending my TED Talk. That, in a nutshell, is how you make a powerful video presentation. As always, in the comments below, let me know what you'll use your next video presentation for. And no matter what you need to communicate in this world, just remember to communicate visually with Powtoon's visual communication platform.